Uh, hello, welcome to USM Tech World. Uh, today we are going to see how to create Windows service in Visual Studio 2019 live. So first uh, you have to select uh, uh, Windows service uh, template uh, in the create new project uh, and then click uh, next button. Uh, it will go to the uh, next uh, screen that is configure uh, your project. Uh. So in the configure, configure uh, your new project uh, dialog box, you have to uh, choose your location, whatever location. I have chosen my location as D and uh, name the project service name. I have named it as Windows Service Live and click create. So this will create a, a new project and uh, it will open the service1.cs file design file so there you have to create the installer so for that you have to right click that and add installer and click that add, add installer and it will add the installer fi files that is a project installer uh, dot cs so go to the code of the project installer dot cs and uh, go to initialize component uh, and from initialize component uh, go to its uh, definition and uh, here you have to uh, give the account uh, account and uh, service name so the project installer uh, account is uh, local system account and username and password is null because uh, it is not a user specific so here i am creating for my own use so i have created uh, it as a local system account okay so this dot service uh, process installer one dot account equal to system dot service process dot service account dot local system and uh, windows uh, service name uh, here you have to give the service name as windows service uh, live so i have named it as windows service live so you have name it uh, whatever you like so save all the uh, things and go to service uh, code behind uh, and write the code now so first uh, inherit the namespace that is system.timers uh, so timer let us start the uh, instantiate the timer here timer tm equal to new timer so here i have to i will be creating the log file uh, whenever the service starts and whenever the service stops uh, so at that i am creating as a log file in the uh, base directory so in on start uh, i have raised our event uh, called elapsed event uh, so there i am calling the elapsed time method uh, on elapsed time so and i will create this method uh, here so i am giving the uh, interval time and enabled uh, enabling the timer so i have i have given the interval time as uh, 1000 milliseconds so for every one second it will call this timer here and in all elapsed time uh, i am going to create a method uh, write file log uh, write to file method so this method will write uh, the message what i am what i have given uh, like uh, service recall set or service start set uh, or service stop set uh, and it will register the time in the notepad so so this will call uh, every time on the one second uh, passes uh, for every one second uh, it will call this elapsed time here so now I am going to write the write to file method uh, and uh, passing a um, string as message uh, and uh, here I am going to check uh, the directory 
uh, first I have to create the folder path uh, so for example uh, here I am taking the folder path as uh, my base directory that is uh, uh, whichever location this project has been uh, deployed uh, that is a debug folder uh. so take the debug, debug folder <coughs> and I am creating my own folder there that is uh, you can get the de uh, base folder or debug folder from the base directory and I have created a log path uh, one folder name that is uh, service log path uh, one folder name and uh, I am checking with the directory name space uh, directory dot uh, if directory exist uh, that folder path uh, if it is not does not exist mint it will create the uh, new folder that is service log path uh, so that is what this coding does if not directory dot exist of folder path then directory dot create directory folder path next I have to uh, I need to create the file path so the for that I am taking the folder path itself the base path so I am naming it as a string file path uh, is equal to folder path plus and uh, within that uh, I am creating a file log file uh, I have named it as a log file plus dot txt extension so then only it uh, knows that it is a notepad file so now uh, I will be using the stream writer class uh, in order to create this file actually here it is uh, giving some error so at the rate of uh, slash means it will uh, take that uh, path uh. so now I am going to create this stream writer uh, class uh, and using stream writer sw equal to file dot create text of that file path uh. so this file will create this uh, path actually and write this uh, content in the stream writer class uh, sw dot write line that message uh, that will be written in the stream writer class uh. so before that uh, I need to check uh, whether this file is a new one or it is already there if it is not uh, the file doesn't exist uh, then that create text will execute uh. suppose uh, if the file exists uh, then I will append the file uh, which is already created in the base directory path uh. okay so now, uh, now I have called actually in non elapsed time so then I have to st uh, call it on uh, on start uh, timer on start uh, so there I am writing, uh, writing as uh, service start set uh, and registering the date time dot now similarly I need to call it in the stop also so service stop set uh, at the particular time so that will be registered yes uh, all the things are over and I have created the service now I have I need to build the service whether it has any errors or not so I have checked all the things yes it is good so I will go to solution explorer and I am going to build the project now Windows Live yes it is built out successfully without any errors and now I am going to command prompt and actually you have to right click as administrator uh, to take the 2019 command prompt uh, and uh, run, it as, run it as an admi administrator 
and take this path uh, I have created uh, where this exe is located that will be that I will copy from here and I have written the command as install till and paste that path and just uh, press the key so actually it is completed successfully the services got uh, created now go to the command prompt and click uh, services.msc so there you will be seeing this windows service live uh, service running so I will be checking uh, one by one uh, ok yes it is there windows service live the service is created and I am starting that service now so now I am going to check uh, whether this file uh, is getting created or not uh, and open that uh, base directory and go to bin folder debug folder so yeah the service log path directory is created and log file text file also created and uh, yes all the things are logged here so we are successfully created the log file so again I am checking by stopping the service and I am verifying whether it uh, logs or not yes it is logged service stops at 723 2020 and 129 pm uh, that's all uh, for today's session so for more videos uh, uh, in USM tech world please subscribe my uh, channel uh, so that you can get uh, more videos on every technology that I have I am learning in my day-to-day -day life uh, thank you thank you for watching